bicycle just felt like from the get-go, it was fast, it was immediate. You know, we have to say it, it's the lightest product in the the world. For somebody that has been cycling for a really long time and they've ridden almost everything out there, now they need to ride. create the world's lightest bike, but also the world's uh, most durable bike. Uh, at the onset of this project, you were the Doubting Thomas. Is that a fair statement? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, the Doubting Thomas in a sense. You were like, you, you set the bar high. En fait, on n'avait pas le choix. Ça a été une autre chose qui nous a amené à faire le vélo aussi léger que ça. Si on n'avait pas le choix, on ne pouvait pas faire de compromis sur les, les, la méthode de fabrication des pièces. We know that lighter weight means more speed or more enjoyment of the sport. <laughs> So it needs to be light. But no, but I mean, like that—that's—that's that's the industry. The way the industry is going, consumers demand light bikes, and it's proof of technology. It's proof that you know what you're doing. I mean, you can almost equate it to the automotive industry as speed. Speed. You know? Yeah, because it's like saying that we have one of the lightest bikes in the world is equivalent of saying, "Oh, you just made the fastest Ferrari." It's what a super light bike should be from the beginning, with no compromises. And we've created a bike that's super light, stiff, and rides beautifully. With the Photon, we were able to do a bike that we're still able to fully customize, but that is still uh, extremely light. And it's all, I mean, we have to say it, it's the lightest production frame in the world. For, for the les, les, les forms, it's been relatively simple. We're going to not have pas de artifice, not anything. We want the most efficient possible. Optimizing shape. In not fidgeting with the ability for a tube shape to transmit the, 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 the inherent stiffness properties. So keeping it round, you can feel that on a, on a bike. There was some severe, like real engineering and manufacturing leaps made with that bike. The fact that we were able to eliminate where, well, anytime you have a joint, right? Anytime where like a tube goes into a tube or any time that you have to join something, you have overlapping surfaces. So the second you remove one of those surfaces, you're lighter. Also think that the building in North America or we just plainly have access to better materials also. The guy who's actually making parts, the guy who actually wraps the carbon fiber can, he's downstairs. Oh, I can go talk to him. You know, like which other company can you do that? Where you have access to the guy who's actually gonna end up making each of like getting his input. Yeah, yeah. Well, and yeah, you know, you, like you, you need the designer, the engineer, and the, the machinist that Everything. has lunch together, the machine <laughs> and the fiber is downstairs. So yeah. uh, for the dropout, we we're able to pull out the molds in a few days, and uh, yeah, I think the machinist <laughs> was able to tell us if it's gonna work or not, if you could do machine. Uh, to test various iterations of, uh, of you know, what the end product is quickly, and, and get it out on the road and test it, and in some cases, certain things Proved to be, you know, inexhaustible, great with layups, things that last uh, a lifetime. Others break like that, so you learn quickly. So it's a, it's a perfect laboratory. And I think I was the first one to ride that bike fairly hard. It was by quite a bit the lightest bike I've ever ridden. And at first, I have to say that it's fairly scary because you feel you just have a handlebar in your hand. The bicycle just felt like from the get go. It was fast, it was immediate. I mean, this bike is just amazing because it has achieved a, a stiffness versus comfort level that I've never experienced in a bike. But there's something characteristically beautiful about the bike that's faster, that's stiffer, that's lighter, and that overall it just takes a breath away. I mean, for me, that bike is not anymore the, the super light bike, it's just the perfect bike. sense something that hmm, right away you're looking for faults and when something is perfect you smile like that blonde that walks across the corner that's <laughs> <a little bit laughs> it's your all smiles <laughs>